Dance master is full of spices, chili powder. Amen. If you like to eat chili, you can join us one day. Maybe in Ida's house. Amen. We can cook in a way that you can get sweat on your head. <laughs> And I tell you, people of God, she told me, you're going to want it because you have never eaten raw fish. I said, I don't care about it. You just, you just go and eat what you want because I know this must be a good food because there's a lot of people standing in the line. And she said, when I took the pieces of, some pieces of uh, the, the fish, she said, okay, anyway, if you want to eat it, better eat it with the green paste they have. So she put all the green paste into the, into the fish food. And I don't know anything about that place. What they call wasabi or wasabi? It's called wasabi, right? And and you know, I came and put my plate on the table, and all my friends were seated before me, Chinese friends. And they looked at my plate and said, Pastor, you like Susie? I said, Yes, I like Susie because my mom name is Susie. <laughs> and you know, they said, Okay, it will be very fine if it's delicious. Eat. And while I was eating, she put a lot of wasabi on it. And even the first piece I cut and put on my mouth, I cannot swallow it. Before I swallow it, you know, the spice went through my nose into my brain. <laughs> and I have to take a deep breath. And all that I can do is, I'm helpless. All that I can do is, I took a big breath, long breath, and sneezed on the plates of all my friends. A very big sneeze, and I felt so embarrassed. And my wife started pinching me under the table. Sometimes you have to listen to your wife, you know that? Not all times, sometimes. <laughs> Your wife may be right sometimes, and don't don't ever skip off a counsel, right? I feel so embarrassed, and she was pinching me and saying, "I told you, I told you, I told you this. You cannot eat now. You are putting, you know, a shame before them." I said, "It's not my mistake. It's you who put that masala." <laughs> This is still going on that happened in the Garden of Eden, right? When God asked Adam, Adam, why did you eat that food? God, the lady whom you gave me, gave it to me. It's going on in every family, even today, right? <laughs> Hallelujah. And I was so embarrassed, and I told my Chinese friends, brothers, please forgive me, because this is my first time, and I have never eaten this before. I don't know this this masabi is so spicy. No, I was looking at their face, whether they are upset with me, but you know what they said, all of them? Pastor, do not worry. Even the sneezing of a man of God is a great blessing, and they started you. <laughs> God will never put a man of God to shame, right? And I tell the people of God, every time I get out of the water, God always asks me, how is your food? Because I said, Lord, if you're not going to give me food, let me go back to my work. And I tell the people of God, God, you know, it's good. And I tell you tonight.